football has the power to enthrall, to captivate, and this occasion appears irresistible. Two magnificent sides intent upon impressing the wider world with a display of technical and tactical brilliance. So much riding on... On this. Well, it's a beautiful day for football. No complaints whatsoever on that front here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary. And alongside me is Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's Manchester United taking on Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek. They did well in their opening game. They looked fit, they played some expansive football, and they worked hard to win the ball back. They just need more of the same today. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Oh, managing to beat him. Still possibilities. The lineup for Manchester United. Bruno Fernandes plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the focal point in attack today, Marcus Rashford. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Nacho Fernandez in central defence. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And it's an interesting looking attacking constellation with three forwards listed from the start. Well, there are many who regard Bruno Fernandes as the complete footballer. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him today? Well, he's a fantastic striker with the ball. He can generate so much pace, and when he strikes it cleanly, the ball starts to dip and swerve on its way to the goalkeeper, which is why he needs to be closed down quickly today. Opportunity it is. A cheeky chip. Well, I have to say, that's a really composed finish. He had to get that absolutely right. He certainly did that. Modric unable to hang on to the ball. Anthony. And now Rodrigo. Disappointing for United to give it away like that. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And support available. And the goalkeeper expertly anticipated that through ball. Bruno Fernandes has it. Good tackle, take it away. Rafael Varane. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, high marks for that pass. A really good pass. Excellent defending. Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. Valverde. And back to Valverde. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Playing advantage here. United keep it. And he's retrospectively awarded the free kick now, having tried to give them the advantage. Snuffing out the danger.
Emphasis on the clearance, a good one. Again, they couldn't keep it, Real Madrid. United could be onto something. And the referee has given the corner. So maybe scope here for them to add to their lead. It hasn't come to very much. Casemiro. Well, the fans are certainly having their say. Just listen to them. They thought that was a penalty. Well, they could run onto it here. A very effective clearance. Marcus Rashford. Oh, this looks useful. Oh, good save. Played over. The defender put in the challenge, and it might be a red card. And it was always going to be crystal clear for the referee in terms of the decision. Well, he had to make it technically. It wasn't a good one. Valverde. Effort from long distance. I'll tell you what, it wasn't a million miles away from the equaliser. Well, it was a decent chance, but they're still behind it. They needed to take that one. Real Madrid's coming away with it. Valverde. And Varane foiling them. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. He'll have a go here. A free kick, and the keeper took it cleanly. That's effective pressure high up the pitch. He's very adept at protecting the ball. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. United being afforded too much space. Marcus Rashford in position. Time and space for Rashford. And a goal here for Manchester United. They are the big favourites now. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box. Begging players to attack it, but you have to question the defending here. They don't attack the ball when it comes in. They don't react quickly enough to close the scorer down. It's really poor defending. Well, without putting too fine a point on it, Real really struggled in the first half. Will we see a response from them in the second? Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Anthony. Great effort to keep that one in play. Oh, he looks threatening. Oh, the post denied him. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Well, so close to extending their lead there. Just a matter of inches. Oh, managing to beat him. Was it the denial of a clear goal-scoring opportunity? If so, he's off.
weaker accuracy, but the keeper able to turn it away. A stunning stop. Well, he couldn't pick out a teammate inside the box. Bruno Fernandes has it. It might be a favourable situation, this, for Manchester United. Oh, goodness, not the best of challenges. Now then, what's the referee going to do here? And a decent delivery. Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. United regaining possession. Well, unable to bend his run offside. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And quick thinking defensively. Released it nicely. It's got to be! And in! Oh yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. Bellingham. He's got to score! And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Marcus Rashford. Oh, and that challenge carried with it quite the element of risk. Now, what's the referee going to do next? And not an attempt he'll be terribly proud of. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Really good, strong tackle, and it'll be a throw-in. Real Madrid have given it away. Now, can they hit them on the counter? Now, can they take advantage? Oh, yes, what a pass. Well, there's something really I can... Catching about a well-executed chip. A bit unlucky there. Well, it's an audacious effort, but he doesn't quite get it right, does he? And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Well, he knows he's on his last warning after that one. Well, I don't think it warranted a yellow card. He made a genuine attempt to play the ball there. Jose Lu. Rodrigo. Oh, that's fine defensive play. And the counter-attack is on, options available. Rashford. Just the challenge that was required. A wonderful intervention. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Cutting in. It's a perfect challenge.
He read the situation defensively and did his job. Good technique displayed. And nothing comes of this attack. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Well, as we approach full-time in this one, Stuart, no escaping the conclusion that United are bossing this. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity, and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. Determined defending. Good ball over the top. Well, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. Here's Diallo. Bruno Fernandes has it. He's showing a real will to win the ball. And Bellingham. Textbook defending inside the box. And the referee blows for full time. Positives for Manchester United. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Well, a highly significant role played by Bruno Fernandes. Sensational performance on all levels. Stuart, interested to know what you made of his production. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?